what's up ladies hey fellas i'm coming to y'all on some real chill because we're gonna do a um, little get ready with me it's me drinking juice out of a red cup but y'all first we're gonna start off with my hair really and truly let me blow that candle out really and truly i was supposed to take my hair down today but i was too lazy and also we were supposed to have um go out to dinner my boyfriend's taking me out to dinner and we were supposed to go out to dinner somewhere else but the places that i wanted to go out at where i could dress up with my heels and be real cute with my new dress they were booked so we're going somewhere else it is still nice but um, I don't think I'm gonna wear heels tonight, but then that could change. So, first we're gonna start off with my hair, girl, because I don't know. They gonna have to make it do what it do because obviously the hair ain't doing what it need to do so the edge just gotta pile I, I usually use um edge control but sometimes i use this got to be and i'm using the got to be tonight because we don't want these edges to go nowhere literally did okay could be better could be a lot better but for the most part I think we did okay cause this is just gonna be for tonight I can see now I'm taking this down I'm just gonna keep those two back there And I'm gonna wash my hands off, y'all, because we gotta work fast. It don't take me long to do my makeup anyway. I don't even know what I'm wearing. So, ooh. I'm gonna do my eyebrows off camera. And I'll just tell y'all what I do on them because I'm pretty sure y'all know how to do your eyebrows. Y'all have seen a million eyebrow routines. Mine probably no different. So I'll be back in a second. All right, y'all. I'm back. I've done my eyebrows. Um, I need to work on my eyebrows, but this is what I do. And y'all, I ain't put no primer on my face. I actually got to get some more primer because I haven't had this primer for a minute and I don't really like it because I got this when I was like, I usually didn't wear like nothing on my face at all. I just used to do my brows and call it a day, right? Do my brows and put some lashes on and that was my makeup. Like then I got into where I would put like a little highlighter on my cheek. And then I got to the point where I was like, you know, I'm gonna use a little bit more on my face. So I use this, I don't use any foundation, but I use this Maybelline Fit Me Powder it's kind of dirty i have a it's, it's old i have a new one i'm gonna put that on i don't know brushes i don't know what kind of brushes these are and they actually look really nasty but they're not like i clean them it's just they be my makeup girls like 
y'all probably don't but if y'all don't go tune in to girls like us tv on youtube and it's like my girl aisha on there um keisha and ashley um two ashley's ashley d and ashley s and then jazz right and they talk about like different topics I wouldn't really call them a podcast because they do other stuff as well, but kind of like a podcast. And they were talking about um, high value men, right? So, like, what do y'all, do y'all, um, what do y'all consider to be a high value male? And when I say a high, I'm just taking this neighborly fit me and toffee caramel and I'm just gonna kind of put that on my eye but what do y'all consider to be a high value meal like I feel like a high value man is a man of substance of course but you know make his own money um got his stuff together pretty much you know knows how to treat a woman that's what i consider to be a high value man i know females or women i know women <clears throat> have their own take of what they consider to be a high value man but that's just my personal you know that that's what i feel a high value man is a man who has his stuff together you know he pay his bills. His bills are paid. <laughs> like, for real. Hold on, y'all. But, yeah. But, like, before I can even consider a man, like, dating you or anything like that, I have to consider you to be high value. Because, personally, I feel that I am a high value woman. And that's because I pay my bills. My bills are paid. No, but, seriously, that's because... You know, I have a lot going for myself. You know, I make good. I require my man to make good money. And not because I want his money, which I do. But that's that's not solely why. It's because I make my own money. And I need you to be making just as much as me, if not more. Okay. This is Black Radiance. <clears throat> so focused finishing powder it's in golden almond y'all all this stuff that be on my face is finishing powder like my whole my whole makeup routine is finishing powder don't play with her so yeah this is how i highlight and i just be learning this stuff myself because like i said i'm not a girl who likes foundation i don't know why because i well i know why I like my skin to feel light. You know, this, when I put this stuff on my face, I still feel like my skin is my skin. I don't feel like I have a lot of stuff on my face. Because I get my makeup done, I have got my makeup done professionally for like photo shoots, graduation, and things like that. And it just be feeling way too heavy, like way too heavy. So what I'm gonna do now is just press this in for the most part. <clears throat> and give myself a little highlight. Y'all see that? Y'all see it. And I'm just gonna go through and not really take it off, but you know, Just go through my foundation brush and just kind of, I don't want to have that flash, you know, that, you know what you get when the camera. Then I just go through one more time with what was left on my brush, I mean, on my um, sponge, and just put that back on my face. And my, like I said, my makeup routine is real simple. I'm just going to put this in the crease of my eyes. This is just like this burgundy type of color. I've been really liking it lately. 
like I said, I don't do too much. Really and truly, I don't do enough. But yeah, y'all, back to what I was talking about with this high value man. So what do y'all leave in the comments below? What do y'all consider to be a high value man? And do y'all want a high value man? Also, do you consider yourself a high value woman? Because I really feel like a man should have everything on his own. And depending on his age, you know, now I know, I know, I know everybody's timing for things aren't the same. But <clears throat> it's just at a certain point, certain things you need to have together. And that's that's just the honest truth. You know, I'm not finna sugarcoat it for you. I'm not finna baby it for you. Because I know that women, we tend to kind of grow up faster than men do but still you know at a certain point certain things should be done in your life like come on let's let's just keep it a honey okay i'm gonna take this like little light color i don't know what i'm doing and i feel like some more stuff should go under my brows because i feel like they're not light enough Uh, if this turn out bad which is not because I do this often I'm just running my mouth you should turn out good yeah see that gave it a little something mm -hmm. it gave me a little something now that's all for my eyes and I'm going to put on my lashes but I like to put on me a little blush, and this is the L'Oreal True Match blush. It's in warm. I don't know if y'all can see that. I try to do a little YouTube. Like I said, my products kind of look like they're dirty because they be in just a bag. So, yeah, I should probably clean them. I mean, like clean the outside of them. I take me some blush and I put it on, I just smile. You could really take this eye color and do some blush. First. Mm -hmm. Go crazy on the cheese. Okay. So, last but not least, I use <coughs> this Milani. It's been wiped off. But this is actually a bronzer. I use it as a highlight because it works for me. I'm a darker complexion girl. Y'all know what I love. Ooh, child, that's a lot, baby. I love being dark skin. You know, some girls, I see a lot of stories about girls saying, like, growing up and being teased and being bullied about being dark skin. I always thought I was that bitch. Always. Like, I grew up with my my, pen, my mom, my grandma, everybody, really, telling me how beautiful I was. My mama blew my head on 10. You know, she always taught me to be humble, of course, but very much confident, you know, carry myself with confidence, walk with my head high. And I still do that. And some girls will, will not like you for that, honey, but me, I love to see other women carrying their self with confidence because I'm like, yes, girl, you looking good. You feeling yourself and as you should, sweetheart. I don't see, I don't be seeing what's the issue with that. This is my highlight. I, I never understood why females would, you know, dislike other females for feeling themselves. Like, what is wrong with y'all? Y'all should want other women to feel, you know, feel themselves. Never down another woman. Always lift the next queen beside you crown if you see it's tilting. This is <clears throat> Master, this Maybelline Master by Face Studio Fix. <clears throat> Y'all, then when I'm done. I, o I OD on the highlights, especially on my cheekbones. I have natural contour face. Okay. I'm just going to take this pencil. <clears throat> I don't overline my lips because I always 
just feel like I'm gonna look crazy, but I do take the pencil and I come in like this. On the pink part of my lip. Y'all see how I do that? And then I just take some gloss. It don't matter. I actually usually don't take this one, but this is beside me, so I like to put like a lighter pink right here. And this is my favorite lip gloss. I'm gonna tell y'all who put me on to Melania lip gloss. Scandal Lex. Oh, Alexis Rebecca. She goes by Alexis Rebecca on YouTube. That's my girl. Hey girl. She put me on to this. And I love it. I hope this video do well. I be really watching my YouTube stuff to see what y'all like and what y'all don't. I know y'all love story times, which we got another one coming real soon. And it's a good one too, Prada. That's enough for the snoring. But I'm gonna put on my lashes. These I picked up probably from a beauty supply store, I don't know. And they call Belle, they're by Kiss. They're the mink effect. I'm gonna throw these on real quick and I'm gonna come back in the camera. Okay, y'all, I am back. I'm not good at the whole mascara on my bottom lash, but I try a little bit. I went ahead and put my lashes on, mascara, and I also put a little bit of eyeliner in my waterline. Product. So yes, these are my baby hairs. This is my hair. I'm gonna get dressed with my fit on. Oh, and I was telling y'all, after I put on my um, after I <clears throat> spray my face, I like to go through with just what's remaining on that brush and just oh, D baby product, rude. I love to oh, D. Oh yes, it's giving me. Mm. Love it. So yeah. And if I forget to tell y'all, my scent tonight is gonna be none other than my fave. I love Toy Birch. But Toy Birch, love relentlessly. Ugh, beautiful nighttime scent, beautiful. Smells so good. So grown. Oh, so grown. So grown, beautiful. I love the scent. So yeah, it's a good nighttime scent. Um, and I'll be back with my outfit when I figure out what I'm putting on. Okay. This is my outfit. My hair. I'm gonna insert some pictures and y'all. I just smell so good. I look so good. I decided I was gonna put some heels on and I'm just gonna quick carry this little clutch details for me. Um, this is my little Versace watch. This is a gold necklace. This is actually a real gold necklace, but I don't have to pin it on. I don't remember where I got these from, but you can get them at Shop Closet 38 um on Instagram. Then just some little coach bracelets and a little ring. So yeah. I'm going to insert my pictures and I hope y'all like this little date night look, date night get ready with me. Some pictures before the sun go down. I really hope y'all enjoyed this get ready with me. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!